I had an uncle that would uh, take, it was my cousin and I, and we started, I think, and we still do it today, it's 40 some years later, but when I was eight years old, we would go, he would take us out of school for a week, and we would go trout fishing up around, you know, all around Center County and State College, Penn's Creek, Spring Creek, always driving by the stadium and through the campus and around that area. So it just, you know, to me, when, when I ultimately got to that age of kind of thinking about where I was gonna go to, to college, you know, that, that Pennsylvania and Penn State was always kind of a home to me, a second home. Even though I grew up in New Jersey, I spent summers up there. I, I just, it was an area that it just was, felt comfortable to me. And uh, interesting, it's, it's really the only place I wanted to go. And, um, you know, I ended up fortunate enough to, to go there. So the Penn State story continued for me after I went there, like most Penn Staters. You kind of get it in your blood and it's part of what we do. A couple of my daughters, I have three daughters, one went to law school, I have a sophomore up there now. It's been in the family for a while for us. Mm -hmm.